25 years, it's been unbelievable to see the collective work of people like you in this room who have believed in that same vision. The way in which each and every one of you have translated that and helped move things further forward to be able to consolidate our own global force to show synergy, to work in collaboration, to be able to think about new ways that we can translate the knowledge and the discoveries to bring resources, to unleash human potential, to standardize our language, and ultimately to continue to see that being manifested in ultimate quality of life, in progress in people with spinal cord injury. Certainly this has been, this is one of the, the fun things about doing the research, is getting out and, and forming networks and getting more heads in the game, because we think that's ultimately how we're going to you know, solve this problem, by getting more people engaged. And so it provides actually a really nice opportunity to, to get out there and, and create meaningful collaborations with people. I think it's a very nice opportunity for the spinal cord injury field to actually see a successful collaboration that has actually moved the field forward quickly. So within two to three years, we were able to come together as a group to uh, establish an outcome measure and validate it um, in, an, in a multinational study. And that's because we collaborated. We have been making exponentially growing progress, and I think that will continue, particularly now that we're actually designing interventions based on the true nature of biology, which is as an information process. Thank you, Doctor. We're thinking outside the box now. We're thinking of how to bring organizations together, how to bring foundations together with governments and together with industry to make an even greater difference. We need to discover better treatments. We need to keep that pipeline of research open by feeding it with new ideas at the basic science level and by examining those ideas at the clinical level. These are the things that are possible. And they aren't just science fiction, they are reality and they are happening today here in this room and around the world. It is my deepest hope that as a result of this conference here at I-2012, that we will find new pathways to work together. To know that if we come this far 